is Eureka Chang. I am the editor in chief at Red Style Media. And I'm Sean Dillman. I'm a comic book creator and illustrator. Star creator. Star. Uh, <laughs> we are a small indie company. We've been in business for about five years. Uh, every year we do a themed anthology. Uh, we announce the uh, sort of theme in January and do an open call for artists and writers. We make selections by March and then the book comes out in October. Uh, we have the first three years we did literary themes. We did Poe, Shakespeare, and a Frankenstein anthology called Unfashioned Creatures. Uh, but the last couple of years we've kind of shaken it up a little bit and uh, we switched to rock and roll. So last year we did an anthology inspired by Queen called Killer Queen. Uh, the artist for challenge to take a uh, favorite Queen song and use it as inspiration for a completely original story. And then this year we did uh, the 27 Club, a collection of comics inspired by music artists who died at age 27. The artists were challenged to take a favorite member from the club and uh, use their music as inspiration for a completely original story. And that's how we uh, met up with Sean. Um, he and his artist, uh, he and his writer, uh, worked on a story inspired by uh, Janis Joplin. Uh, and you can see that right here. Yeah, right. My writer is uh, Mario Calendaria, and he, uh, he did, it was, um, it's not Freedom's Just Another Word, is out of, it's the lyrics from one of Janis Joplin's songs. This is my first one working with Red Stylo Media, um, but also this year, along here, uh, me and my writer, Stephen Petrovelli, are debuting our new comic, which we put together ourselves. Uh, it's called Sweetie. It's kind of like an action hero comic book about this girl who's 14 years old. She grows up copying comics and movies, like, oh, I could do the stuff Bruce Lee does if I practice. And when bad guys start showing up, she already like knows what to do. And it's kind of our fun adventure story. Uh, well, um, 27 just got picked up by Action Lab, uh, their Danger Zone imprint. So 27 is going to be in comic shops in December, but you can go into your comic shop and order it now. Um, and then they also picked up a new graphic novel, um, it's original, uh, one of mine, called The House of Montresor. And if there are any Edgar Allan Poe fans, um, it is a sequel to Cast of Amontillado. We get to work with some fantastic people. Um, we're a really small company, but Red Stylo Media has published over 200 uh, artists and writers in just five years, and that's just an amazing... We've met some wonderful people, and coming into comics, some people were incredible to us, and it's been great to work with veteran artists, but also give new artists an opportunity to be published for the first time. There's nothing better than that feeling. It's amazing.